Hello students. State Bank of India that is SBI releases the SBI PO application form every year. The application form is released in the online mode and the students who are interested can visit the official website of SBI to fill the form. Although there are some important instructions which the candidates must go through before filling the application form. Going through the instructions for filling the application form will help the students avoid any mistakes and fill the form smoothly. In today's video, we'll overview how to fill SBI PO application form while covering all the important aspects such as process to apply, application fee, documents to upload and more. So without further ado, let us start. First, let us look at some important points regarding SBI PO application form. The SBI PO application form is released every year by State Bank of India that is SBI. The form is released in online mode only, there is no offline mode form accepted for SBI PO. The candidates must check their eligibility first before applying for SBI PO as if they do not fulfill all the eligibility requirements, their application form will be rejected and the application fee for SBI PO is mandatory and non-refundable that is once you have paid the pay it won't be refunded that is why it is very important that you check the eligibility first before filling your application form. The fees for SBI PO can be paid online using modes such as debit cards, credit cards, internet banking, IMPS, mobile wallets, etc. The candidates must keep a printout of application form and e-receipt which will be generated after your payment which is very important and can be handy for the later process. The information that you fill in the application form will be used for all the further processes that is why it is very important that you enter all the correct information in the form. Now let us look at what are the application forms fee for SBI PO. The fee for application form for SBI PO is different for general category and reserved candidates. For general and other category candidates, the application fee is 750 including all the charges. And for SC, ST, PWD and other reserved candidates, there is no application fee that is zero application fee for SBI PO. Now let us look at what are the document you will be requiring for SBI PO application forms and what are the specifications for those documents. The documents which will be required is scan photograph and scan signature. The photograph should be recent, passport size, color picture. The dimension should be 200 into 230 pixels and size should be 20 to 50 KB. Signature should be on the white paper with a black or blue ink pen. The dimension should be 114 to 60 pixels and the size should be 10 to 20 KB. Now that we are done with documents and application fee, let us look at what are the different steps which you will follow to fill the SBI PO application form. The very first step is to go to the official website of SBI PO and register on the portal. For registration, you'll need your personal email ID and contact number. Make sure that you enter your personal contact number and email ID because you'll be getting all the further details of the exam on that personal ID only. After you are done registration, you'll get the registered email ID and password on your mobile number as well as your email. You can use the same credentials to log in again to the portal and fill your application form. In filling the application form, the first step is to upload your photograph and signature. You'll have to upload the photograph and signature as specified as we have already discussed the specifications for those documents. After you are done uploading photograph and signature, you'll have to fill the form regarding your remaining details such as your postal details, your educational qualification, your work experience and other details. After you are done filling the form, you'll have to review your form. Make sure that you review the form very correctly and all the informations are inputted very properly because it won't be edited later. After that, you'll have to pay the application fee. You can pay the application fee in the online mode only using the modes that we have already discussed. After you pay the application fee, a receipt will be generated. Make sure that you download the receipt and save the application form for further processes. That's all. Thank you. I hope that this video will help you understand how to fill SBI PO application form. If you have any further questions, you can ask me through the link that is visible on your screen. Also, if you are looking for direct admission, you can also fill the common application form on the link that is visible on your screen. For more updates on SBI PO and other exams, stay tuned to College Deco. If you like this video, do like, share, comment and subscribe to our YouTube channel.